We're here at the photo shoot for the APU Good Times Tour. Now imagine this, one stage, four legends and goodness only knows how many hits. Starring musical icons, Russell Morris, Richard Clapton, Leo Sayer and Joe Camilleri. All proudly brought to you by APIA, celebrating over 50s, living at their best. Welcome to the uh, APU Good Times Tour. Fantastic to be on it. You're looking forward to it? Yes, very much so. You bet I am. With three great buddies as well. It should be very funny, a funny tour. It's well balanced, you know, because we've got two bald-headed guys and two guys with too much hair. I know, I know. I'm, I'm in the hair contingent. <laughs> <laughs> Leo could shave all his hair off and it'll grow overnight, you know. Is this going to cause friction, do you think? No, no, no. I think, I think it'd just be cheaper on the hairdressing bill. That's all. <laughs> Are you suggesting the four of you are gentlemen and uh, it's all going to be love and kisses all the way through the tour? Well, it better be because I'm tougher than the three of them, so I'll, I'll give each one a whack in the ear. Now, Joe, this is the second day for you to it. You obviously didn't stuff the first one up because you're back with us again. Well, uh, so it seems. I had such a ball. The whole audience would just get up and sing all the songs and they just go nuts and you say, it's great to be alive. Thank you, everybody! Now, you had a stint as the front man of the Party Boys. Mm -hmm. What was it like? The way the general public would perceive an old rock band like that to behave was well, they were right. <laughs> <laughs> I believe in flying the flag and growing old disgracefully. Girls on the avenue. I'm going to be 66 in May during the tour. I'm proud of my age and I'm, I'm proud of the fact that I don't seem to be feeling any older. I'm active, I still believe that I've still got something to say. You know, we are relevant and I think it's inspiring for people to see that, you know, when you get to our age, it's still all happening. I think I've made 45 albums in my 50 years of being in the music business. I'm still doing it. I'm an entertainer, that's what I do. It's not just trying to get in there and say, you know, I stopped in 1975 and I'm just getting my paycheck. Age hasn't wearied you? It's wearied me very much, but uh, never to worry. I'll, I'll, I'll persevere, you know, you just keep dancing till you fall. You love performing though, don't you? I do, I think it kind of, um, the energy that you get from it, you know, it heals all pain. <laughs> it really does. I've had a, a you know, sciatica, we, you know, and I've had all the ailments, bad backs and, and all those sort of things. But you hit the footlights and then you get that energy and you explode and you just feel great. It doesn't matter what happens after that. You know, you just go home into your little pod, then you wake up and you crawl. And, oh. When you're going on tour, what can we expect backstage in the green room? Uh, green tea, herbal tea or something like that? Perhaps I'd best, best keep that to myself. I am the real thing. Now, at one stage here, I reckon it was pretty tough to get a word in there. Oh, look, we have, uh, you know, four beautiful big personalities that all enjoy to have a bit of a chit-chat, so... Leo, a bit more nose towards the camera, please. Lady Gaga! Leo? Yeah! Leo, a bit more... Leo! Oh, yeah. well, you, you know, but that makes it a lot easier for us as well because if they're having a great time, uh, then we'll just capture the moment and it will show, you know, how much of a good time they're having. I've had a really good time on the set with the guys today and everyone is really pumped about the APU Good Times Tour and they're certainly ready to rock Australia. So stay tuned.